watching and there's people as you don't. The winner is usually based on who was able to do clean air at the same time still bring the heat with a predetermined amount of rounds, you know, in, in those big stage battles. Mm -hmm. You know, OGs will have an off days, news maybe have an on day. Does that make the beginner better than the OG? Probably not. In a, you know, in actual battle, it's different. I don't think a lot of b-boys understand that, mm -hmm. you know? I think that what's, what's hard about being a judge, first of all, you know, this is, you know, I do this, I, you know, but judging is a, is a pain. It's very, very difficult. So the, the, the level is a specific place right now. But one thing about being a judge is I say this, you have to have, you just can't go into a judging situation with anything on your mind other than just looking at who's going to bring it. Now, you can't say, oh, well, this guy's champion last year, so, you know, who's this guy? None of that applies. You have to put it all down. I love everybody, but I don't care who you are. It's about who's going to bring it right there. I've seen people that I've been booed because I called it, you know, the right way. Even though the dude, like, I've been, I've, I've been in situations where somebody just came out and smashed the dude that everybody thought was going to win the competition in his first round, and I got to call it like it is, because then I don't, need, I don't, I'm, I'm going to lose sleep behind it, because you guys can all tell me what you want to tell me, but if I know I fucked up or made a mistake, excuse my language, I have to sleep on that. I have to live with that. And as much as I like dudes, I'm like, I've been in battles where I'm like, ah. Oh, Damn, because I like people. I'm like, yo, I want this dude to win. Deep inside, I love this guy, but I can't be your friend, dude. I can't be your homeboy right now and give you a hand. You better do it yourself. You know, you better do what you got to do. So it's hard because I think a lot of judges lean in that category and also worry about the audiences and if the audience is going to hate them. And I've been there. I've been in a battle where the whole audience was booing me. And I had to take it in the chin. But you know what? At the end of the day, everybody got it. B-boys that understood said... Ken, don't worry about that shit. You did the right thing. You know? And um, so you got to deal with that. I got to walk away. I like to be liked. I was hurt. Man. I was looking at people. They were like, eh, just screaming at me. In the, uh, it's like, what the fuck did I do? Damn. And I, was, I felt hurt. I was like, yo. You know, and a lot of people probably, uh, this was in, the, I don't want to say country, whatever, but a lot of people were there for the guy that, uh, that lost, that I said, no, you, this guy took you. And so they were all mad. They, they're like the whole town, I think, was in the audience with... So, you know, but then again, like I said, I come back here and I can talk about that and I can say, you know, I'm fine. You know, if I would have said, damn, these people are going to get pissed at me, boy, let me vote for this dude. I would have messed up. I would have been one of a lot of fans right there. They'd be like, yo, you're the best. But I would have been alone saying, damn, man. My boys would have came up to me and said, yo, Ken, come on, man. The art is about rocking a circle, man. It's about having fun. You don't need to fucking go to a contest. You know, you rock the circle with your friends or, you know, when a battle happens, it happens. But I mean, rocking the circles is the shit. You know, that's the fun shit. Going in and rocking the circle with a bunch of good dancers and shit. That shit is fun, man. It feels good. You know, I, I, when the moment presents itself, I jump in and I try to enjoy it, man. I just try to enjoy the moment. So I think when people practice so hard to think that they need to be a specific way that they're seeing, and their body doesn't allow them or their commitment doesn't allow them or their injuries don't allow them, they get discouraged and want to think that they can't be a b-boy or can't be competitive. And it's not true. You know, it's just going to make your work harder for you. You're, you're going to have to do something, turn your weaknesses or whatever you think they are into, into positives and find a way to win. Because at the end of the day, if I have two dudes in front of me that are both equally nasty as shit, nobody's fucking up. What do I, what, what do I drain, draw from to make my decision? And a lot of times it's that fire inside of here, that desire, that want, the person that, that wants it more is the one that I'm going to lean to.